Hello and welcome to Tutorials Point. Today in social media marketing, we'll discuss about the best practices you can think of implementing as far as your social media marketing campaign is concerned. Now, what are those best practices you can implement? Let's check them out. First things first, let us analyze these figures and statistics. In Twitter, there are about 500 million tweets are sent every single day, 500 million tweets. Facebook 4.5 billion likes in Facebook per day, 4.5 billion likes are given on Facebook every single day. Now on Instagram, 95 million photos and videos per day. These are staggering numbers, unimaginable numbers you can ever think of. Now, when you have such traffic floating on social media, you can never think of staying away from social media to promote your business, to generate the kind of traffic that is needed for your business and leveraging social media marketing to improve and grow your business. And these are basically the statistics that you need to think of when you actually go on creating a social media marketing campaign for your business. Now how to get started as far as social media marketing campaign is concerned or the best practices that you can think of implementing in social media marketing. The first thing is the optimization part. What you need to do is you need to optimize your social media marketing platforms. You need to optimize your web assets. When we talk about web assets, we have the website, we have the blogs, you may have a landing page, or you may have an e-commerce portal. These are your web assets of your business. You need to optimize them to the optimum level to ensure that the user that is coming from social media platforms, they get the best experience, they get the best value for the kind of products they may want to buy or they want to engage with you for the kind of services or solutions you are providing. This is the first part of optimizing your web assets. The second part is of course the optimization part of your social media pages, whether it is on Facebook, whether it is on Twitter or LinkedIn or Instagram. You have to optimize your pages. Optimization in the sense that you know you need to have a very good banner, the logo, the bio, the about us page, the images, the videos, everything has to be optimized to ensure that you know people who come to your social media pages, they get the best experience. And this is the first thing that you need to optimization. The second is of course the content strategy. You need to have a very clear cut, robust, comprehensive, illustrative content strategy for your social media platforms. You may have a content strategy for Facebook, you may have a content strategy for Twitter, on Instagram, on our LinkedIn. What you need to do is you need to have the complete content in place, the first point. The second point is of course the content calendar. Build a content calendar for respective social media platforms or channels and make sure that you know, follow the guidelines and ensure that the content is posted regularly on each and every social media platform. Then of course when you have the content in place, when the traffic is floating on your social media pages, what you need to do the first and foremost is listen to the people, listen to the users, listen to your prospective customers. What normally businesses do is as soon as they post the content, they optimize the pages, they go on hard selling their products or services solutions. That is not going to work. Social media is all about listening to the customers. The foremost point is Try to understand who your users are. Try to understand what are their issues and concerns and challenges. Try to understand what they are looking for and listen to them first. Then of course, then you go on providing the kind of services or solution that you want to provide. But foremost is listen to the users. Then engage. The engagement comes after listening to your customers or prospective customers. Try to understand what is that they are looking for. Then engage with them. Engage with them in such a way that you know you promote your business. You tell them, okay, this is our business and this is what we are doing. This is how we do. And these are our best practices. These are our credentials. These are our case studies. 
you engage them with the kind of content that you are posting with the users then once you have the engagement in place you are in a much better position to convert those users to convert those leads into customers and this is actually the process how you can get started as far as social media marketing campaigns are concerned then comes the best practices you can think of implementing as far as social media marketing campaigns are concerned optimize the pages the first and the foremost part you should have a very good banner the size as required on the social media platform the logo the content the address the about us everything has to be in place optimization plays a very important role in engaging and driving traffic the second is of course the targeted customer when you actually build your social media marketing campaign what you need to do is you need to actually identify who your customers are the demographics and the geographies this is extremely crucial so that you can build the content targeted towards your customers the content has to be absolutely precise and targeted the more the targeted content the better the leads and the conversions then analyze the insights the insights play a very important role how your campaign is faring on multiple social media platforms whether it is on facebook or twitter or linkedin or instagram whichever the platform it is the analytics is the backbone of your campaign when you actually engaging with your customers you have optimized the pages you have created the content you are posting the content the content is targeted the users are coming but you have to actually analyze the kind of traffic that is coming the engagement that is happening these are the factors that actually provide you the insightful information as far as the performance of your campaign is concerned you need to analyze the insights which is basically the analytics which is basically the social media analytics each and every social media platform whether it is facebook twitter linkedin instagram they provide wealth of information as far as analytics is concerned besides these insights besides this the inbuilt analytics there are also many social media analytics available use them leverage them and try to understand your campaign performance tweak them wherever necessary and keep on driving traffic to your site listening is of course a key important and key component of your social media marketing campaign make sure that you know you understand and listen to the users listen to the prospective customers listen to what they want to convey listen to understand their issues concerns and challenges once you know what is that the customer is looking for you will be in a much better position to engage with them and explain what you can do how you can do and how you can provide a right fit solution or a service or a product to the customers the value is extremely important when people are engaging with you on social media platform you provide them a value value actually helps you in differentiating and distinguishing you from the rest of the competitors there must be some value that the user should get the customer should get then of course the trust plays a very important role you are engaging with the users from multiple places from multiple locations from multiple countries and they are actually trusting you and believing you that you know you will deliver the right kind of service or a solution to them and you promise them that you will deliver something to them and when you actually go on delivering those solutions and services when they become your customers make sure that you know you deliver on promises each and every promise that you make to your prospective customers on social media must be delivered the more you stick to the timeline the more you stick to the deliverables the more you stick to the promises that you make that is how you actually build trust trust plays a very important role and this trust will actually get you more and more customers more and more leads because that is what matters at the end of the day then of course leveraging influences is plays a very very important role there are many people out there on social media who listen to this influencers who listen to this subject matter experts who listen to this experts and they their matter their advice matters a lot and most importantly try to attract and engage with the influencers and get them on board and have a 
review written by them and this influences matter a lot as far as social media marketing is concerned because people would love to listen to what the experts are saying on a particular product and they go by the advice by the experts. Then of course the conversion, the conversions play a very very important. When you follow this practice, you are sure to get the kind of conversions that are needed as far as making your social media marketing campaign a huge success. Some of the guidelines that you can think of implementing as far as your social media marketing campaign is concerned. Create positive experience, extremely important. You need to create a positive experience over the entire campaign. The kind of content that you are posting, the kind of engagement that is happening and the kind of content that you build and formulate across the social media platforms. And this plays a very, very important role. Encourage participation. The more the users get engaged with you, the more the positive results. Engagement plays a very, very important role. There are possibilities that not every user may be happy with you. There are possibilities there will be a certain kind of a criticism related to the kind of product services solution that you are selling. Make sure that you, know, you engage and try to understand what are their issues and try to solve their problems. Listen first and be responsive. Whenever you see a comment or a post from a user on any of the social media platform, make sure that you respond to them quickly and immediately. And that plays a very, very important role in building the trust and the value. Create calendar, avoid over posting. When you have a calendar in place, make sure that you know the content that you post on social media platforms, so whether it is on show Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram or any other platform, make sure that you know you post them regularly as per the calendar and never over go overboard in posting. Make sure that you don't over post. There are certain rules that you need to follow like how many times you can post and what is that you can post in terms of content, in terms of videos and in terms of images. Honesty, integrity and value is the utmost and the important point. Be honest with your prospective customers, be honest with your leads, tell them what you actually do, what you actually cannot do and make sure that only you add value to them. Make sure that you know you are honest, you are truthful and you are actually telling them the truth. That actually drives the campaign a huge success. Make sure that you know you avoid the shortcuts and tell them that you something that you cannot do that you will do that is not going to work. Be honest and truthful and it takes a lot of time for you actually to build the kind of customer way that you need to build but that is actually the best way in engaging the user and make sure the most important point is the, the guidelines, the terms, the privacy policy of respective social media platforms are very important. More often than not what we do is when we create the pages on social media for our business, we actually accept the terms and conditions privacy policy without reading them. Make sure that you read the privacy policy and the terms and conditions of each and every social media site. And this is very, very important so that you can avoid the kind of mistake that you can avoid in terms of violating the privacy and the term. Reading of privacy policy and the term is extremely important if you want to have a successful social media campaign. In conclusion, what we have seen in this video is first things first, of course, how to get started as far as social media marketing campaign is concerned, the best practices and the guidelines you can think of implementing to make your social media campaign a success. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you again.